Nnamdi Kanu is sponsored to thwart Igbo chances for presidency in 2023. An Igbo professional group coalition of South East Professionals Network in Nigeria and diaspora has alleged that desperate politicians feeling threatened of the chances of Igbo to produce president in 2023 were sponsoring Nnamdi Kanu leader of outlawed indigenous people of Biafra IPOP to scuttle the bid. This came as it condemned the activity of IPOP and its leader Mazi Namdekanu, asking governors of the southeast region Ohanese Indibo and well-meaning Igbo sons and daughters to rise against the indigenous group by denouncing it wholeheartedly. It insisted that the region must be vigilant and not succumb to Kano's antics of speaking or carrying out his actions for the Southeast interest. In a statement on Friday signed by its National President Professor Madhumire Chika and National Secretary Mazi Anayo Uchemba, the Coalition of Southeast Professionals Network in Nigeria and Diaspora alleged that a certain Nigerian politician from the South is bankrolling Kanu to scuttle Igbo's quest for presidency in 2023. It claimed that it has been vindicated of its earlier position that certain forces were behind the IPOP leader and his inglorious activities following current happenings around him. We wish to authoritatively say that Mazin Namdekanu is not working for the interest of Indigo, rather he is being bankrolled by a certain Nigerian politician who is contesting the 2023 presidential elections from the South against the Igbos, it alleged. We have vindicated by the findings and happenings around Mazin Namdekanu, the fugitive leader of IPOP, and we call on all Ndigo around the world to distance themselves from this Kanu and his Boko group. It added, according to the Igbo group, this politician is doing this through some of his key aids to cause disaffection in Nigeria between the Igbos and other regions of our country. The politician, having realized that the general mood in the country now is the high sympathy Nigerians have for Igbo people in 2023 general election decided to employ this method to set Indigo up against Nigeria and we must not allow this. It further said, it alleged that Nabdekanu held several meetings with these people in the month of December in France and another meeting on the 10th and 11th of January 2021. This is why we have always warned people on the character of Unamdekano and IPOP that they are on self-serving mission and not an Igbo agenda. Kano is working with some fifth columnists who are out to rob the Igbo of the presidency come 2023. We must not allow this fugitive to succeed. We are aware that Apart from the little dues IPOP extorts for members and sympathizers, his major fine funding comes from these desperate politicians. Thank you for listening to this news. Lies. Lies. Pure lies. See, look at them. See, this is formulated lie this lie is formulated to 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 make indigo see reason why they should not go on with the um with the Biafran agitation now let me tell you they are failed because why the people they are actually talking to are already absolute minded and focused members i've never seen anyone that can deceive ipop members i've never seen that person the person should go and try again 
the place you go and try again because IPOC members are the most difficult people to, to confuse. See how the lie was cooked and prepared. Do you think you are talking to kids that a coalition is now liaising with Inam the Kano to deny Indigo their presidency? The beginning from the onset, Inam the Kano has already said no to Igbo president, you don't know. He has said no already. How do you know? Do you know the juicy position that was given to him for him to turn down to turn down Igbo uh, to turn down Biafran agitation? What you are saying now is it better than the juicy position given to him? You cannot deceive Indigo now. You can deceive the Eurobars but you cannot deceive the Igbos because Indigo, once they have made up their mind, they have made up their mind. I have not seen that person that is going to confuse them or, or convince them from, 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 from what they are doing. Do you understand? So, I am of the opinion that Bibia France shown any, sided, any side talk. Do you understand? And this is one of the reasons why I said that... Um, Partisan, partisan, uh, partisanship is not something that one really needs to put into consideration. All right, you, you understand what I'm saying? Because when you put partisanship into consideration, definitely at the end of the day, you end up um, getting it wrong. What these people are trying to do now is they are trying to win your mind away, win your heart away from where Biafran agitation is. Because they don't want you to carry on or continue with this pursuit. Because they have seen the possibility of it, of it being actualized. Do you understand? So that is what they are trying to do. But um, there is no way they are going to succeed now. Because the people they are dealing with are the well-known Biafrans. Do you understand? Now? So there is no way it's going to happen. And there is no way it's going to come to pass. Alright? So, um, my viewers... Um, I call on you this day to come in and air your own side of the opinion because you, you can hear, since you can hear all that has just been said concerning Inam Kano and um, its many plots, which I know that it's a formulated lies. Do it free to come in and air your own side of the opinion. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell button to get updated whenever we upload any new videos. Thank you.